reach for the sky and nothing's falling down Oh, everybody knows how the story goes But fairy tales have been lying to me Every time I try, you just run and hide Now I'm finally feeling free Tell me, can you see me now? While I rise above the ground Okay, checking in here at uh, the port of Catoosa, Max Port of Catoosa, Port 33, here at the Oakley Port. And uh, been doing the Super U for the last two days. Sorry I didn't put anything out here today. Uh, it, was kinda on the, it was kinda the same old, same old, so I didn't do much. But uh, they're doing uh, driver appreciation out here today, doing burgers and dogs and that sort of thing. So stopped and got me a burger and dog and heading back to do another one. So that's what's up to date. So, off we go. Thanks for showing me all that I am about. Oh, everybody knows how the story goes. But fairy tales have been lying to me. Every time I try, you just run and hide. Now I'm Just when I realize you've been shutting me out I start to reach for the sky and nothing's falling down Oh, everybody knows how the story goes All right, real quickly, before we got here, we're at the uh, Port 33 in Catusa And the line on the right is the low drain all the way back there. And then that line there, you can see the scale house way up there. I'm at the corner of the stop sign. It's, it's a low drain on the south end. So as you can see, I'm about to load some uh, not load grain i'm sorry load fertilizer on the south end so that's what's up with me gonna take that to comanche texas tomorrow uh this line is long i've been in it 34 minutes and had to change the view on the camera it was a little too close so i've been in line for about 35 minutes now and now i'm on the straightaway here i think it'll be another 30 minutes before i'm on the scale and then um, we'll just see how long the line is back there to get loaded because there's this line, then you get in the next line, and then you get in the line to leave, and then you leave. So, uh, I think, I think from right now we're, we're minimum hour and a half to get out of here. We'll see. I'll let you know when, once we get loaded how long we're actually here. So, but that's it. That's what we're waiting on. So... Get loaded and get the heck out of here. Oh, I got something to show so, you. So, what I did was I got some shirts made for my channel to kind of promote it and that sort of thing. 
Um, so this is just so everyone knows. Uh, when I'm doing this here at first, I'm just gonna get. I'm just want to make these available for actually Oakley drivers, and I'll see what kind of uh, what kind of uh, response I get for them and people that may be interested in them. So I got from large to 3x, um, and so if any of you Oakley hopper drivers are interested in them, shoot me an email. Uh, I don't, I'm really not really interested in trying to mail them off. I mean, if I have to, I will. But if you see me, come see me. Uh, they're 20 bucks. I'm not trying to make any money on them. That's basically what I got in them. Uh, it's not quite 20 bucks, but you know, I don't want to charge 18, 22 because that's just stupid. So anyway, if you're interested in the shirt and you want one, come see me. It has that on the front? That's actually the back. The front is that. So this is OHD for Oakley Hopper Driver. Then the uh, Oakley Hopper driver subscribe on the back. So if you're interested, shoot me an email, let me know. And if you're Oakley Hopper driver, come see me if you want one and I'll hook you up. Well, I did get out of the port, just so you know, I was uh, in line, loaded, and out of there two hours, two minutes. Um, honestly, I've spent a lot longer than that at 3M before. Uh, so, even though the line looks long and daunting, uh, it moves along pretty quick for the most part. So it wasn't as near as bad as I thought it was going to be. Uh, so got out of there. I had about an hour left to drive. Uh, so I made it down here to my hometown, Okmulgee, Oklahoma. And uh, going to park here for the night, get this video downloaded and put up because I haven't put up one in four or five days and uh, need to do so. And uh, that's it. Uh, got a lot of uh, got a lot of guys thinking about coming to Oakley. Talking to a lot of you guys the last few days. Good to meet you. Good to talk to you over the phone. Um, and uh, I just be aware, you guys that do apply, just be patient because uh, I know those guys. They have to be very thorough in their backgrounds, and uh, a lot of times, you know, they're waiting on uh, former employers and that stuff to contact them back or to answer the phone basically and uh, sometimes it takes you to be proactive yourself to make that happen but anyway that's going to be it for tonight um, and we're heading down to Comanche Texas tomorrow and get this offloaded I noticed on the weather map it's storming like crazy down in mid Texas so uh, I guess some look like I got some severe weather down there so we'll Hopefully it stays clear of here. I'm not even sure what the forecast is. I need to look at it, pay attention, being I'm in Tornado Alley right now, and uh, and do that. So that's it. Again, on the T-shirts, if you guys are interested in, uh, you want one, shoot me an email and let me know. Uh, on this first batch I have here, I'm going to kind of reserve those for the Oakley drivers that might want one, and, uh, and I, I'll work out how to get them to you guys that if, if I don't run across it from you, uh, if I don't run across you very quickly and uh, we can mail them out to your son. I just, you know, check with the post office. And it'll, it'll just usually cost a couple bucks to send it. So um, we'll get, we'll get something figured out if you want one. But anyway, uh, that's it for tonight. So remember, if you like the videos, give me a thumbs up and share them and like them and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And until probably tomorrow night, you guys take it easy. Now I'm fine